Welcome back to Defense Team News. I'm Nicole Power. And I'm Lieutenant Jamie Breslin. Here are the headlines at Defense. May 31st marked the launch of the first ever Defense Team Innovation Challenge, which allocates $1 million to support the development and implementation of ideas that DND and CAF members submit to modernize defense. This is your chance to demonstrate creativity, resourcefulness, and ingenuity, to put your ideas into action, and help build the defense team of the future. Civilian and military members are encouraged to submit their ideas by June 30th. Submissions will be assessed by a panel of experts from a variety of fields to determine which proposals will receive further consideration. To submit your idea and to get additional information, visit the Defense Team Innovation Challenge GCpedia page and the related links. Canadian Armed Forces members from Fleet Diving Unit Atlantic recently participated in Operation Open Spirit in Estonia. This annual operation strives to reduce the threat of explosive remnants from the First and Second World Wars within the Baltic Sea. Specifically, the operation targets the disposal of sea mines and other munitions remaining on the seabed off the coast of Estonia. It is hosted on a rotational basis by one of three Baltic state NATO members, Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania. Hosted by the Estonian Navy, this year's version of the operation was supported by Canada, Denmark, Finland, France, Germany, the United States of America and other partner nations. Team Canada recently competed for the first time in the 2018 Warrior Games at the U.S. Air Force Academy in Colorado Springs. The 18 members of Team Canada competed in 11 sports against more than 300 ill and injured Armed Forces members and veterans from the U.S., U.K. and Australia. The goal of the Warrior Games is to enhance the recovery of ill and injured Armed Service members and veterans through sport. The participation of Team Canada is made possible through the Canadian Armed Forces Soldier On program. Before we go, a reminder that this week is National Public Service Week, an opportunity to celebrate and recognize the contributions made by federal public service employees across Canada. D&D employees are encouraged to post pictures of their team celebrations and events on social media using the hashtag NPSWDND2018. Event information is available on the National Public Service Week internet page. That's it for us. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. For Defense Team News.